Back with you today to talk about hydraulic tanks. This is a hydraulic tank out of a Broderson IC80. I want to explain a couple things to you about what goes on with the tanks when we get a crane here. A lot of the tanks with this sitting in the crane have at one time or another lost the lid or the lid was loose on it. So we look down inside there, a lot of times there's water mixed with hydraulic fluid causing freezing conditions in the cold weather. So we take the tank out of the crane, clean it all out, remove this shutoff valve, and inside here there's a cone-shaped strainer in here so dirt and stuff doesn't get into your filters if it comes in through the top. We clean all that out, reseal all the threads and put it back together. Reseal these threads too because a lot of times the tape gets hard and old and causes leaks. The one place over and over again we keep seeing leaks on these particular tanks from people putting stuff next to them and stuff is on the sides and on the back. As you can see we got this side all scrubbed down, it's black here. So we, when we pressure test them we can look for cracks or rub marks or dings or holes or whatever so we can fix them. This particular one had a little spot we had that was suspect, but once we pressure tested it, um, it was okay. So I just thought I'd give you a little...